lovelies, it's Jen here. It is Tuesday about, I'd say 11 o'clock, and I'm gonna do a quick haul, back to school haul. Now my kids go back to school in two weeks, so they start the first week of August back, believe it or not, even though it's still in the 90s and 100s here. Don't ask me why we don't take a full summer off. But we don't. So at any rate, I wanted to show you some backpacks that I picked up and just do a quick haul. So the first three I ordered were from the Disney store. And I let each of the kids, the littler kids, pick their designs. Rio, who just saw Finding Dory, picked this backpack. It's a Finding Dory backpack. And it's a full-size backpack. There's the straps right there with the fish on them. It's got side pockets for water bottles. It's got one big, actually it's got more than one big, zippered compartment. It's got a small one in the front right here for prizes, maybe candies, things like that that he earns in class. And then I didn't realize, but it has two zippered pockets. A front, which has got a spot for pencils or pens. Let me get in there so you can see it. Here we go. Oh my yeah, so it's got a front pocket down there for pencils and pens. And that's like the smaller pocket, so that would be the supply pocket. I mean, it's a full-size pocket, but the smaller compartment. And then the main compartment is toward the back. And if you unzip that, it's got a spot right at the top. I can show that. For writing his name and then it's just a standard backpack there's no cushioning because he doesn't bring his laptop home he does have a laptop at school but they don't bring it home till fifth grade so he can still get away in third grade with the littler kids backpack so that's the one he picked Alton picked this one from the Disney store this is spider-man and it's kind of an interesting hard texture which I wasn't expecting so I don't know how comfortable it's gonna be but he seems happy and then this is what it looks like from the back and then from the side it's got interesting like spider-man cartoon print on it and it does not have a front pocket like Rio's did but it does have the compartments on the side for water bottles um, Alton's in first grade, so he won't have a cell phone to put in the other side, but he can use it for his water bottle. And then at the top, it's got one and two, a small zipper pack for the spot with the um, pencil supplies, and then a bigger pack for school. And I'll go ahead and open those up. I'm sorry that this is such a weird video. I'll have to edit. But that is the smaller pocket. Let's see if I can get that. The smaller pocket is there. And then I will show you the bigger pocket. Back here. And again, it's got a spot for his name right there. And it's the bigger compartment. So that is his backpack. And again, I got these at the Disney store. And I got them on sale. They're regularly, regularly $22.95. And I got them for $17. And I got the pencil pouches as well. So I'll show you those. And then finally, Diego, who's starting kindergarten, picked out Star Wars as his backpack. So. And his has a different little flap, so I'll just take the time to show you that. There's just a small flap in the front, which I think will be perfect for putting those notes that the teachers send home about different events. I'm going to teach him that that's what that's for. And then his, instead of zippers, which hopefully will be easy for him, is just a Velcro open instead. And then I'm going to plan on leaving the zipper open so he can just put his he's got one pocket his supplies in the one pocket now he won't be taking anything to school the kindergarten is completely um, provided so he won't need to take anything with him so that's good oh I can't get the zipper one-handed so hold on one second that's good but at any rate yeah so he won't need any supplies with him 
he'll just be bringing homework home. So, but I'm just gonna do the Velcro and leave the sides halfway zipped up. And that way he won't even have to bother with zippers. And I think that's a really cool feature. And it does not have side pockets for water bottles, but that's okay, because he only does a half day. So this is the Star Wars one, and he really wanted it because it has the BB-8 on it, and it's got the TIE Fighters and Stormtroopers. He just really liked it, so that's the one he picked. Now, for pencil pouches for them, they don't really need them because they're in, for school school. They just take small ones, but I got ones for homework from the Disney store so that when it's homework time, we don't have to go through the hassle of trying to find their stuff. So this is the one that goes with Star Wars. It's got a Stormtrooper face. It's hard. And then inside, I just wanted to show you how much it came with. It's got scissors, a ruler, a glue stick, a racer, and a pencil sharpener. It's got marker pens, a regular writing pen, colored pencils, and regular writing pencils, all pre-sharpened, and a notepad. So that is what came inside the kit, because it didn't look that big online, but... I was really, really pleasantly surprised. It's got basically everything they need to do to start their homework. And I'm not gonna have to buy anything at home for homework, just what the teachers want for school. So that's what I got for Diego. And again, those were safety scissors. And then I got Alton, the Spider-Man one, to match his Spider-Man. And it's got the same stuff inside, safety scissors, glue stick, crayon, not crayons, uh, color pencils, regular writing pencils, a regular pen, and some markers, colored markers. And then this one I thought was the cutest one. This is the Finding Dory one, and it has the same thing as the other ones, and this is to go with Rio's. So I thought that was really cute. So anyways, that's Rio's. So that is what I got from the Disney Store. And those guys run $16.95 regularly, and these were on, on sale with the backpacks so it was a really good price I think they came down to under ten dollars so that was good so if you're looking for something you might check the Disney store um, the backpacks last the whole year I will say that the materials a little thicker and they typically last the whole year unless they blow a zipper so that's pretty good and then for my older kids only two of them needed backpacks this year I'm really particular they have to have the kind that the kids use at college basically with the cushioning for the laptop because I don't want any fees for a cracked laptop screen and that's why I didn't want them to have laptops but the schools are kind of like everybody has to have laptops so they get like college ones with the um, padded backing for their laptops and Berkeley's is still good Savannah's is still good and Jackaroo's was still good from last year so I didn't have to replace those at all so I only had to replace two the first one I got, and I got these from Pottery Barn Teen. Isn't that cute? I got this for Coda. This is on clearance. It was on the sale. So the regular price, I don't know if the tag is on here or not. Let's see. The regular price, no, the tag's not on here. The regular price of this was probably like 50 or 60 bucks. All right, and I got it off the clearance because this was last year's design for like 29, I think. So I thought that was really good. It has the cushion straps. Let me turn this around so you can see. And it's also thin air breathing material so they don't get so sweaty carrying all their stuff. The backpack back here has got foam padding and that's where the laptop is gonna go in the back sleeve. Of course it has a side pocket for water bottles and phones. It's also got the zip ties up here for them to hang shoes of and then it's got a small pocket here. This one is to attach something to. It comes with the clip like keys, but it also has a little port in there so you can just um, put something else in there that you don't want to lose. And then it has a bigger pocket here. And there is a spot for your earbuds. I don't know if you can see that right there. You can put your earbuds in there and listen to your music while you're carrying your backpack around. And then I got her the matching pencil box that matches. Again, this is it's called Gear Up from Pottery Barn Team. They're water resistant material, so if they get wet, they're gonna repel the water, which I think is great. They're also just washable, so that's super. If you need to, you can do it. Um, and then up top, you've got a spot to put your like change anything you need to get to really quickly 
right here. Can you see that? There's also a spot here where you can run your earbuds from that other hole through so they come out. So you plug it in there and run it right through the top there so that you can listen to your music on the go or listen to your phone, whatever. And then, of course, it's got the main comp compartment to put everything in your backpack. So that is the backpack that I got. This is from Pottery Barn teen and like I said I got this and I got Travis's which is the same still a tech gear one um off of Pottery Barn teen as well this one was only $19 and it was regularly like 60 again it's going to have that foam backing for the laptops it's got an extra loop here for keys it's got the same spot up here for the earphones to come through. It's got a lob here to hang something from. The ties th that can be tightened. I don't think I showed you that on Coda's, but it's got a button so you can tighten it and just click shoes or whatever in there. Spot for water bottle or whatever on both sides. The small pocket up here. And then over here, you've got a medium pocket. And then you've got the large pocket that you're going to be putting your homework and your laptop in. So again, this one is from the Gear Up collection. And um, it's like the kind you'd use in college. But I find that these have lasted. Like three of them made it through last year with no problems. And I'm just reading the side. And I think I got everything padded back, side mesh, water repellent. It's got a carrying handle at the top. I don't think I showed you that. It's got the bungee cord. And it's these are both, the nice thing about Pottery Barn is they're made in the USA, so you are supporting um, USA made products, which I don't think I mentioned. So both of these, again, were on the clearance. So if you go to Pottery Barn, if you're looking right now, and you go to the clearance section, you will find these two and several other styles. So instead of paying 60 for those kind of college backpacks, you can pay like $20 or less. So I really, 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 and you can add a coupon to it. I got a, I think I had a 20% off coupon off, that they just had on there that applied even to sale. So I was able to tack that onto the sale price. So the price came down and if I could get the pencil pouch basically for free for Coda. And I don't didn't show you Travis's, but he got one that is Camo Army pencil pouch too out of the same material for his backpack. So that is my quick haul. I just wanted to show you what I got for back to school for my kiddos to start them out right because they are like oh, only two weeks away from school. And I would say for everything you see here, that there's that I would, I came in under $200, definitely. I probably came in under $150 for everything you see here, including the shipping. So, um, again, you can find the same designs at DisneyStore.com or PotteryBarnTeen.com. And if you go to Pottery Barn Teen quickly, there's still probably 15 to 20 backpacks like these, um, different designs there on the clearance, and you can just grab them up and save a lot on really good quality backpacks. All right, that's it, lovelies. I hope you're having a great day, and we will see you on the flip side tomorrow, Wednesday. Bye.